Hey everyone, Force Restart here. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to make your audio ID public in Roblox. So let's get started. So right now I am in Roblox here. And the first place you want to click on is create up top here in the top navigation. From here on, you're going to be on this page and you're going to click on creation on the left menu here. And then you're going to go to development item right here. Now once you get there, we're going to click on audio right here, for audio section. And you need to upload basically your audio that you're going to make public. So you're going to go ahead and click on upload asset. Now remember it has to be in three of these formats that are listed and can't be bigger than 20 MB. And the audio must be less than 7 minutes. So you can upload anything that's 7 minutes or less than 20 MB. And then you're going to click on upload and then select the audio file here. I have the audio file, so I'm gonna go ahead and select that. And then you can give a description or you can even give it a name. And once you're ready, you can go ahead and click on upload to upload your audio file. So we'll take a few moments depending on how big your file is. And once you upload it, you're gonna Go back to your audio. You're just going to refresh this again, basically. You should see the audio file, and then you can click on that audio file. And then we're going to go ahead and we need to enable this, but to distribute on the creator store. However, this can't be done unless you submit it for review. So that audio has to get review, reviewed first. So all you do is submit for review. And a couple things here, you need to verify your ID for this. So you need to verify if you haven't done so and then agree to all the terms and conditions here, these four, and then hit submit. And once you do that, sometimes it takes uh, like a second to get approved, sometimes a couple hours to even a couple days. And once it's approved, you can come back to this audio and then turn this setting on and that's going to make your audio ID public on Roblox. And then you click on save changes so that's how you do it i hope this video was helpful if so please consider a like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks we'll see you guys next time